I was a bit nervous. I didn't actually want to ask for prayer at first, but there's that thing in you that's like, go on, do it, just be bold. So there's, I think God rewarded that. God rewards those who diligently seek him. I didn't actually mean. Help me pray. He actually said those words, take her to heaven. Wow. Holding my hands. And um, I was standing here, um, I'll demonstrate. I was just standing here, because then I'll get into it. I was just standing here, hands here, eyes closed, and I could feel everyone around me, but I did not want to leave that place. I was standing there for a good few minutes, weren't I? Just, I thought I looked really strange just standing there. Yeah, I saw there. you, you were just standing yeah, there. Yeah, just standing there. I was like, I can't leave this place. And I did actually leave. I think I left a bit too early, but I was like, I can't <laughs> leave. This place is amazing. So first thing, um, someone was pulling me, and um, years ago in my childhood, um, there was a guy around. Um, he was a bit simple. He lived with my grandparents, and I used to always get mad at him all the time for many things, and um, he died. Um, however, I think I was about 13. I was so mad at him because he'd spilt something on my new Nike shoes or something, and um, I never like got to make it up with him or anything like that. Um, and he died, and I felt that oh, I never got to do anything. You know? So anyway, he was pulling my hands, and it was like we kind of, I had to even forgive him, because I don't know if there was stuff that had gone on that he did, because it was a bit special or whatever, but I had to forgive him first, and he was pulling me and I entered the gates of heaven. Um, and Jesus was pulling me as well. So I think there's something in being forgiving people first, because it sets you free, takes you higher when you're able to forgive. Doesn't matter what they've done to you, just forgive them. So I, I'd forgiven him, and then um, God took me to a golden room, and I, I saw people singing and worshiping, and my granddad, um, who was my father figure in my life, my dad wasn't around. Glory. He died about seven years ago, six years ago. Anyway, um, I saw him there and he was kneeling down and um, there was like an altar and he was just praising God. And um, he used to be Greek Orthodox, but he used to always worship and be the singer. There was like two men that used to sing and he loved singing all the time. He had an amazing <laughs> voice. So he's in heaven and it looked like he was just there all day, every day. He was on his knees to God. That's his life. That's his lifestyle. So I was just like, wow, that was amazing. So he was just there. And then Jesus came. I didn't quite see his face, but I just saw white cloth. And then um, he took me and he was dancing with me. Um, oh, yeah. You know, like a daddy and daughter dance that you might have at your prom when you turn 16 or something. So he was doing that. Um, and you mentioned something about princess, something, something, something. And um, <laughs> God put um, a crown on me, like a princess crown. You know, like when you're playing as a kid and you wear the dress up shoes and the crown. So yeah, I was like a tiara. So I was wearing a crown and it was a gold crown. Wow. Um, so God was giving me that, I guess, authority, because we were praying earlier in that day about authority. Um, so he was dancing around me, and that was amazing. Wow. And then God took me back to where the altar was. Um, before that, um, there was marshmallow chairs as well. Yeah, come on. Yeah. There was like that's a chair, that's I found something, and it was full of marshmallow, and it was an amazing chair, Woo! so there's that in heaven. Yeah. Um, and then, so, going back to it, so I went back to like where the altar was, and I felt like... God was saying to me that um, whenever you need something from me, you just come back to this altar, to this room, to this place. And it was like God was giving me access to go back. Earlier that day, someone was giving me a word about, um, he said, what is God telling you? And he said the word singing to me. And then I said, what do you mean about singing? And he said, I was called to write. I had no idea because I don't even think I'm that good at music or anything, but if God's called me, then that's great. So God was showing me this altar and he was showing me that when I go back to that altar, God will give me the words to write. It won't be anything to do with me because it's less of me and more of him. <laughs> and so God, then I was talking to you guys about, oh goodness, it's, it's when you relax. It's not about your doing. It's not about anything you've done. It's about God's work on that cross. It's all about him. It's nothing to do with you. You could be the best singer, the most amazing person acrobats, but it's not about that. The, the second that you step back and let God step in front of you, you are then elevated. Amen. Because it's God. Because there is no one like God. So the more you shrink, the more he gets bigger. If you try and get bigger by yourself, Preach. you don't you get about this bit bigger, because that's your own works, isn't it? Yeah. So, so God was giving me that revelation, and it was like, I can just go back to that room. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Take whatever yeah. I want, because when I take what he has given me, I'm not myself anymore. I am in his likeness, in his image. <laughs> I'm doing my calling. Amen. So it was just like less of me, more of him, but he gave me a revelation of it. Um, so then I'm trying to see if there's anything else that he was showing me. There was a swing in heaven, beautiful swing. It was just so beautiful. And 
everyone was worshipping Jesus while this was all going on. <laughs> so there is victory when you're worshipping, when you're praising Jesus, you bring down the strongholds, you break barriers, you've got to oh. forgive as well. And God was just showing me all these things in like 30 seconds. And I didn't want to leave, but I just thought I looked a bit strange standing there like this. And then I was crying because I saw my granddad who I hadn't seen forever and he was like encouraging me because he would always encouraged me when I was a kid. I used to play football um, like professionally and things. Um, and he would always say, well, every time you score a goal, you get a pound. And he was, he, was, he was that role model. He would always encourage me. But since he died, I kind of didn't have that anymore. But he was just out there saying, well done, keep going, you're doing it. And that is like God, OK? He is telling you, get up off your feet. This is, your, this is the day God has made rejoice. And you just go and you take your destiny. You walk by faith, not by sight, says God. And you walk into your calling. You're not letting the enemy raise the left or the right, says God. You walk forward with your destiny that God has given you because then the weapon will make you can prosper, says God. Not that it may knock you out, but it will not prosper. That means you stand up tall, God is God teaching me, with that crown on your head, and you say, thank you, God, I'm here, take me, use me. That's all you need to do. for God, then yeah. you guys are all hungry because yeah. you're yeah. here yeah. at the time. Yeah. Yeah. Audacious. Yeah. He, he also said that uh, water to wine. So uh, Mary, uh, when it wasn't even Jesus' time, right? Yeah. Yeah. And 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 Mary persuaded Jesus to move before his time. God said that about her today during the prophecy. Wow. Audacious. That's all I can say. Man. Hey, I want to get saved now. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Hey. <laughs> Whoa. Where do you go after that? <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> Glory. Glory. What do you want to do? You want to pray right? for Deborah? Right? Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> you had a dream of death. Yeah. You go ahead and pray for Deborah. Yeah. And yes. You know, just before you pray, you know. Hey, look, this is a prophetic guy that just so much stuff going on. She's carrying something. Oh, yeah. I, want, I want in on some of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Someone went to heaven yesterday. <laughs> she come back. I want Woo! in on some of that. Oh. <laughs> so please, you pray for Deborah. Yeah. And then anybody else that wants prayer, <laughs> fresh man from heaven, just come out and we'll pray. Yeah. Christine, just, just, yeah. just, just pray. Yeah. pray. Yeah. pray. Like, bind this dream up right now in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Command, Lord, every stronghold that rises against her. Yeah. Like I said earlier, that when the enemy just tries to come one way, he tries to come and get you, you just say, no, you rebuke it in Jesus' name. So we rebuke it, Lord. When two or more are gathered, there you are, Lord. And we stand in agreement right now. We break, Lord, this dream, Lord. And we reverse it in the spirit. And we pray she gets them regularly, Lord. I command them all to stop right now. From this day, we speak change. Lord Jesus, we speak to the root of it. Lord Jesus, if it's anything, Lord, I just break insecurities right now. We speak, Lord, the love of God, Lord Jesus, to be May, oh Lord Jesus, I pray you will pour out your love, Lord, and it will cast out fear, Lord Jesus. I pray all the fear, Lord Jesus, will just be bound, Lord, and these dreams, Lord Jesus, I break them. I break the spirit of death, and I speak life, Lord. I bring Amen. life. Resurrection life, Lord Jesus, into her life. I pray, Lord, the calling on her life, Lord Jesus. I pray she will walk in her calling from this day, Lord. 
Lord. I pray she will not be held back because she is young. Hey. Email says, God, she yeah. he's going to use her, Lord Jesus. She and I pray, Lord Jesus, that you, she will step out, Lord. She will not be afraid to step out, Lord. If, you, Come on. if God gives you words, God says, just step out. Just yeah. step out and wow. say them, says God. Step out and say them. Don't be shy. Don't hold back anymore, says God. Because he's given you gifts, Lord. He's given you great gifts, and he wants you to share your gifts. He wants you to share your gifts. And I pray, Lord, that she will share her gifts, Lord. Her call. And I pray she just step out. I just feel like you need to just step. Step out into it. Lord, thank you, Lord. Lord, and just touch her, Lord. I thank you, Lord. You have just she kind of you have taken down the blinds, Lord. I thought like they were blinds, Lord, blocking her from seeing, Lord, you. And I pray she will Let's see go. you, Lord Jesus, in these dreams instead of death. She will see you, yeah. Lord Jesus. Man. Now she will see godly yeah. dreams. I pray she will be like Joseph, and she will have dreams, oh, prophetic yeah. dreams, Lord Jesus. And I pray, Lord Jesus, that you will rise her up, Lord Jesus, because you have called her. She kind of, and we are called her, you have called her, Lord Jesus. I pray. Rise up and be that mighty woman of God you've called her to be. Yes, Destiny, Lord. Yes. We speak it, Lord, and we agree in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 And please pray that fresh manner. Everybody who just wanted to receive that fresh manner, just come. Yeah, come on, man. Jesus, I just speak to everyone standing here right now, Lord. I just pray, Lord Jesus. Revival fire on this man right now, Lord. I pray you will anoint him, Lord, with a fresh anointing. Baptize him right now in the Holy Spirit, Lord. Shikara Wait, away the tears, Lord Jesus, where he has cried, Lord Jesus, where he has cried, Lord Jesus, over things. Lord, and said to God, help me. He's been on his knees, and I pray, Lord, that you will answer them prayers right now, Lord. You will answer them. You will answer them, because anything we ask, According to your will, we will receive in Jesus' name. Whoa, she cut up. But I pray, Lord, you would just touch him, Lord, with your fire. With your fire, with your fire. I pray he would dream of heaven tonight, Lord. I pray he would dream, Lord Jesus. He would dream of heaven, Lord Jesus. He would dream it. He would dream. You would give him strategies in these dreams, Lord Jesus, as to where to lead the church. You would give Holy Spirit strategies that no one else can think of because from you in Jesus' name. She cut up. I pray, thank you, Lord Jesus, this man. Thank you for his joy, Lord Jesus. Thank you that you have given him joy, Lord Jesus. So much joy, but I pray you give him more joy, Lord Jesus. More joy, more joy to the root, Lord Jesus. To the root, to the root, to the root. We bind up anything, Lord you. We speak life over him. Life, 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 says God. Life, life, life. I speak life over him and his family, Lord Jesus. I pray they would walk in their calling, Lord Jesus. They would rise up. But whatever ministry you've got for him and his family, Lord Jesus, youth work, I don't know what it is, but I speak that you will use them in and they will just walk in it. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Oh, my shikarabara, oh!
break any ungodly dreams right now. We reverse them all in the spirit. Every assignment against them, we break. I pray you will touch her, Lord Jesus. Sorrow may come in the night, but joy comes in the morning, says God. Joy is coming. Joy is coming. I speak joy over her. I speak destiny. I speak increase. I speak over her mind. She has the mind of Christ, Lord Jesus. I break every wrong mindset in her mind or where she thinks she is not anything, Lord. I break it. I break it alive from the enemy. What's going on? What's going on? Let it go. what it means but God is saying that you are amazing he loves you he loves your name I don't know why he's saying that but he loves your name she can I speak you Lord and oh Jesus I pray you will fill up with your glory I see you dancing I see you dancing oh, you dance again dance again and when you dance around the circles you will break the strongholds that you dance around you know when say yes 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 that's it that's it walk around yes 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 she can I when they Lord Jesus, he'll get promoted as soon as he starts that job. Lord, 
back free, Lord. Just pray an amazing job over his life. I speak a destiny, a calling, Lord. You are so pleased with him serving at this church as well, Lord. God is pleased with you. He says he is pleased with you. And I speak the right wife into his life. I speak the right financial things into his life. And I speak the right everything, Lord, that you have. The destiny you have called him. I pray he's walking. He wouldn't be swayed to the left or right. But he will just read his word more. And he will just fly after he reads your word. Amen. God has come to set you free. And she can I break every chain that is not of God. Right now I break it. I break every ungodly. She can I break the title and I just speak your will. Thank you, Lord Jesus. You are going to come and you are going to turn his life around too. I pray from this day you will turn it. Can you do a turn? Turn his life around. She can I break Yes, Lord. You have turned his morning into dancing. You have turned his sorrow into joy, says God. Do not look back anymore, says God. Walk in your calling. Walk in your destiny. She can I break in the name of Jesus, she got to walk in your calling, your destiny. I speak the will of God. She got a prophetic anointing. I pray you will see dreams and visions. You'll prophesy over people, and they will be saved, healed, and touched. In Jesus' name, she got a bada bada. I speak the peace of God over her mind right now. She can always sometimes she can't decide the right thing, don't know what way to go. I pray it'll be your Holy Spirit will tell her what to do and where to go. She can I pray she would have that mind or that mindset. She can I pray you would be healing right now to this mind. Healing, 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 healing over these thoughts. I pray Lord. she can I she will take every negative thought captive. She can we bind every negative word. Every okay. negative word spoken against her that she's believed, Lord Jesus. I break it, Lord Jesus, off of her life. I command it to stop in Jesus' name. She cut her the name calling. She cut her whatever it is, Lord. I break it. I break it. She is not a failure. She cut her. She's made in the image of God. She's Christ's righteousness. She cut her. There is nothing you cannot do. Do not limit yourself, says God. She cut her. Because I do not limit you, says God. She cut her. More, Lord Jesus. More. More. More, take away the heartache, Lord. She's gonna take away the pain, Lord. She can have a bada 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 bada. I set her free in the name of Jesus. Speak freedom, freedom from heaven, Lord. She can have a pray, Lord. She will see heaven. She can have a she will see you. She will see angels dancing around her. She can have a because you love her, Jesus. You love her so much. She can have a you have come. You have come. She can have a in the name of Jesus. Speak life, 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 life. She can have a in Jesus' name. She can have more, 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 fill up more. More, 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 not just a little bit, but a lot. She cut up, 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 she cut up,